Students all over campus are learning about a new way to recycle water, and it involves fish. We think that aquaculture is sometimes called the blue revolution, and it's accelerating. At University of Arizona, we've been doing research in aquaculture for more than 40 years. Today, that research has expanded to involve other aspects of aquaculture, like aquaponics. Not mature yet, the lettuce, so it still needs a week. Students like Bruno Sorosi get a hands-on learning experience inside the U of A's aquaponics greenhouse. Aquaponics is when we mix aquaculture with hydroponics and use the waste from the fish or shrimp as the fertilizer for plants. The plants filter that water, then we can take that water and put it back onto the fish. This unique cycle allows plants and animals to work together in a symbiotic way that in turn can benefit our own needs. We can put very intensive food production systems close to a city. We can deliver the fish live. We can deliver really fresh vegetables right into the urban area, reduce food miles. Sorosi is studying the relationship between tilapia and lettuce inside this climate-controlled greenhouse. We have the fish that we have to feed them. So they're going to grow and release the affluent in the water. He says that aquaculture and aquaponics are new ways to improve food production. I believe that the way that we're doing agriculture now, we're not thinking about the future. Both student and teacher agree that these systems provide environmentally practical ways to produce food. It's a really good lettuce. Possibly being the future for agriculture. We feed the fish, the fish digest that, release the effluent in the water. But that effluent is rich in nutrients. So why just waste that and release that in the environment and pollute uh, water bodies if we could just grow plants? There's going to be millions new jobs in, in this field. And from a research standpoint, Arizona being one of the leaders in research education, I think the students who come through here are going to have lots of opportunities.